Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard and in today's video, I'm going to go over an idea I have about an Encanto attraction at Disney Parks. Now, once again, this is not um, a confirmed attraction, it's not even, probably not a, even an idea. This is what I would absolutely like for, uh, for an Encanto attraction coming to Disney, to Disney Parks, specifically California Adventure. Um, which can use some more attractions, but anything Animal Kingdom, any type of um, Disney park where an Encanto attraction can fit. So let's go get right into it. So I think Encanto would work absolutely perfectly as a Mystic Manor style attraction, focusing on the house. You can explore each character's room, the kitchen. Bruno's little secret cave there, but imagine that going through each room in the whole Encanto house, especially because the house is a magical house. So going through this house and Mystic Manor track this style, uh, track this right style attraction would be super cool. It would, it literally, it 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 it, it lends itself perfect perfectly to an attraction. I mean. Everything would be moving. It could be numerous uh, special or practical effects and animatronics. Um, we have the iconic songs. And, of course, we don't talk about Bruno playing as you head through Bruno's room. And then each character's song, Surface Pressure, for uh, when you go through Luis's room. And then you can go have the whole family in the kitchen, maybe. It would be a really, really awesome idea. I think it would be actually perfect. And, <laughs> I mean, it shouldn't take too much of a big footprint either. Because, again, it's just a, well, a Haunted Mansion takes up a, a big footprint. But I think that would be the perfect dark ride for California Adventure specifically. Because they can use a high capacity, no uh, height limit, no, yeah, no height restriction uh, dark ride. That's an e-ticket that could be very well uh, accommodating and could be, again, and maybe that Grizzly Peak area, uh, oh, eh, or I guess maybe the, the Paradise Gardens Park area replacing Goofy Sky School over there. Or even maybe in the Disneyland Ford uh, in the expansion pad over there because it really, in my opinion, needs to happen. Or even, again, Animal Kingdom. Place down on land USA and a Kanto Han uh, Kanto Mystic Manor style attraction. Um, I mean, and the whole movie it's just so colorful, you know, the movie's very bright, colorful, each door lights up. Um, and just imagine the you know, the special effect or the practical effects, as well as the you know, the technology. That they use with the uh the lighting effects this could be an absolutely beautiful attraction just as beautiful if not more so than a coco attraction um at the disney parks which should also also come to california adventure or a disney park because that is a ride deserving of an attraction but yeah and Contra is just such a beautiful park and again it doesn't take place too many it, there's, there's not too many locations. It's just the house. The main attraction is the house, which is why a Mystic Manor a style attraction would be so perfect. You can explore the whole house, go up, go explore both levels, explore the major characters' rooms, um, interact with some cool animal animatronics when you go into uh, Aunt Antonio's room. And yeah, it would be just really cool. It can, uh, it can employ kind of that Beauty and the Beast style um, track this, uh, dark ride segments when they're, like, all dancing together, saying, in the be our guest scene, that can be, like, a, employ that musical number, something like that for this dark ride attraction here, but yeah, Mystic Manor and Kanto style would be fantastic, in my opinion. Another park this can work out is Epcot in the Mexico Pavilion, although I know it's Colombian, so I guess it wouldn't be too, like, on point, but they can, uh, 
you can kind of mix mix mash the Mexico pavilion into like a just a Latin America pavilion, kind of retheme the pavilion to Latin America, then this would fit perfectly there as well. As that's in the theme, they can keep the three the three cabrillos Cab cabrillos attraction there as well in the in that Mexico pavilion and that in console there as well. I think it would be absolutely perfect, honestly, for Epcot if you were to, if we were to go to Disney World because I think and diverse of culture they have over there uh in this movie and again in that pavilion and the epcot also could use a nice uh, just something like spaceship earth a high capacity a no height restriction or no height limit um or height minimum um e-ticket dark ride attraction and that would be just beautifully and again it's such a mega hit on disney plus right now uh and what the, we don't talk about Bruno and it's all over TikTok. This would be a massive hit if it were to be developed in a couple of years and open at one of the Disney parks. So yeah, again, this is all speculation. Just no, uh, not even speculation. It's just my opinion. It's something I would absolutely love to happen in the future, particularly the near future. Disney takes a while to develop and uh, implement attractions, but this one they just I just they just take the Mystic Manor ride system and just theme it to Encanto instead of Mystic Manor. Um so it shouldn't take too long to develop. But what do you guys think? Would you want an Encanto Mystic Manor style attraction at Disney Parks? Oh, any Disney park? And which park would you want it at? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, press that thumbs up button. Subscribe for more theme park updates, and as always, have a fantastic day.